here's meteorologist Pete Mangione with your live Pinpoint Doppler 12 Futurecast. All right, a much improved Saturday on the way after the cool and chilly Friday and then, of course, all the rain we had earlier this week. We're going to see some clouds around this morning and then some brightening by the afternoon. Starting things out with some clouds at Narragansett Town Beach. Temperatures still holding in the low 60s. Over here in Newport, we also have some clouds. Fairly light winds right now and overall fairly light winds throughout the afternoon. And from the hurricane barrier in Providence, this building in good shape, but we do have overcast skies with our temperatures generally in the low to mid 60s. 63 right now in Taunton, 62 New Bedford, 64 Providence, mid 60s from Newport to Westerly. 64 right now on Block Island. Here are the dew points and when we have dew points in the low to mid 60s, that's where you start to feel it a little bit. This will actually increase throughout the afternoon, so it's going to end up being kind of a muggy late morning and afternoon with the breezes right now out of the northeast at six miles an hour in Providence five in Newport. Our winds will eventually try to shift around from the south, but I think five to ten will be it for the wind speeds today, so not a really breezy day by any means with live pinpoint Doppler 12 showing the bulk of the showers offshore towards Martha's Vineyard, Nantucket, a few clustered here in Connecticut. These will try to scoot through and we will have the chance of a shower or two over the next several hours, and that's because we have a front and also the center of low pressure, which is departing, but as it makes its pass away from us. It may give us one last dose of showers this morning. And then with the heating of the day this afternoon, it may boil up a isolated shower or thunderstorm. In fact, we can detail that part of the future cast for you. This is nine o'clock this morning. A few scattered showers out there again, not raining the whole morning or anything like that. We're not expecting any downpours. Noontime lunchtime looking dry. And then this afternoon, notice what happens. These little showers kind of pop up just like popcorn. So if you do get a shower or a thunderstorm, it is very, very brief. Whatever you're doing outside, you can go back to doing it after the shower passes on through. And then this evening through tomorrow, you could see a lot of sunshine. In fact, a fantastic Sunday on the way with humidity at acceptable levels, not completely gone, but it's decent. And then into Monday morning, this is 6 a.m. Notice some more showers and downpours approaching from the west. We'll be watching a few systems to move through next week, giving us the chance of some showers and thunderstorms today. We're going to see a cloudy start temperature around 70 by lunchtime, becoming more humid. And then three o'clock in the afternoon, a spotty thunderstorm or showers possible temperatures in the mid to upper 70s. Along the coast, we'll see those temperatures a little bit cooler as those breezes come in out of the south. But again, it's a pretty lazy flow of wind today around five miles an hour, but it should be enough to make the coast a smidge cooler. So temperatures in the mid to upper 70s from Providence and the Smithfield, likely low to mid 70s for places like Westerly, Narragansett, Newport and Jamestown. And then tonight, if you're out and about, should be fairly pleasant with temperatures holding in the low 70s. On the water today, we'll have waves around two feet in Narragansett Bay. As I mentioned, not really that windy today. Winds starting from the north and then shifting around to the southwest at around five knots. High tide on the way at 104 this afternoon. Low tide 623 this evening. And at the beach this weekend, I would definitely say tomorrow would be the better beach day. You can see sunshine, dry temperature around 77, but it's not bad today. It's doable with some early fog, perhaps a brief shower in the morning, one again in the afternoon, but plenty of dry time to enjoy the beach with temperatures in the mid 70s. So in the seven day future cast, we bring in a beautiful Sunday, 85 degrees, a little warm, a touch of humidity still there. Monday, 82 chance of some showers popping up on Tuesday, Wednesday becoming a lot more humid highs in the upper 80s. Wouldn't be surprised to see a few 90s there and then the chance of some showers and thunderstorms on Thursday. So Julianne, we kind of take baby steps towards some nicer weather today. Absolutely. They say be careful what you wish for people who complained about the heat and humidity. Look at yesterday's weather. That's right. It's really yeah. hard to get right in that sweet spot, right in that comfort zone around here. Goodness, let's get summer back. Thanks, Pete. Yep. Covering New England this morning.